Yeah, so uh, what we're going to do is, and we're going to fire an object, uh, launch an object, uh, going to launch that thing at that angle. Um, uh, put it on top once. And we'll just have it omit one and recycle them. Okay, so um, uh, someone was asking how to make a setup where you hold a button and it kind of powers up the strength of the shot or whatever, and then you let go and then it shoots it at that um, strength and stuff. And the next time it's kind of reset. So, um, Obviously, to to have something just shooting, then I'll put it onto circle actually, um, and we need to put this onto remote control so we can just we don't have to possess anything. So each time we press circle, it fires a new one, which is fine, um, but we want it to kind of power up over time. So uh, let's use a timer. This time we're going to use speed mode, uh, which uses the input to start timer as the speed it's going to play at. So if you set it, send it a 1, it will play at normal real time. And if you send it a 0, then it will just stop and not play at all. And then if you send it a minus 1, it will start playing backwards. And any values you want, really. So let's wire circle into start timer. So now... Uh, if you just watch this thing, the face of that gadget, if I hold circle, then it's going up. And when I stop circle, then it's stopping. So hold it. Um, but we want it to reset also when we start holding it. So we can plug that into re reset timer. And we hold it and then stop. And then next time we start holding it again, it resets. Um, now we want this um, emitter to use that. What we'll do for testing is we'll put it onto continuous and every one second it'll emit another box. It's kind of way over there, and it? Let's put that there. Like that. And we can put this timer output, uh, which again is the current time uh, divided by the target time as like a fraction percentage of it. Uh, no, we don't want to do that. We want to put it into emit speed. So now if it's got no speed and then I, as I as I hold circle it will increase. Uh, okay. Uh, I'll probably turn that up a bit. Um, and then uh, the last thing is we want to emit it once when we stop holding circle. So for that, we use a signal uh, manipulator in custom remapper mode, which just has more things basically. And then we go um, pulse at off. So when the signal coming from here, when it goes to zero or minus, then it will send a pulse and we want that to pulse that on so it's so when this stops being pressed then it will pulse that on for a single frame so now if I hold I'll show you that again hold circle that's still like way over there okay and I'll hold it on so it don't take so long um then let go and it's fired it at a stronger thing and then if I just hold it for a short amount then it's just shooting very weakly and that um, and you could have some readout like, uh, like that and just put that in there to show how strong you've uh, set it Thank you.